Yes, you read the title correctly. I'm about to share with you a very powerful concept that gets overlooked in the trading industry and show you that it makes money by testing it 100 times. Please hit the like button so more traders can see this and let's get straight into the video. One indicator, one time frame, completely free, can be traded anywhere with your phone, even on MT4 and MT5. This powerful indicator was invented by a man named Dean Malone. He wanted a way to see the bigger picture with ease and designed this tool to assess the overall market conditions. And on top of that, having an indicator telling him exactly when to take buys and sells. Just like a buy and sell indicator on TradingView, but better. We are going to check out the higher time frame market and let the indicator tell us exactly where to enter our trades. But don't worry, this can be used for scalping too. So let's set it up. Naturally, we are going to open TradingView on the chart. This can also be created on MT4 and MT5 mobile, but there's plenty of videos on YouTube for that. But right now, I'll show you how to day trade with this like a pro. Click the indicator tab at the top. And just before we add this indicator to the chart, let me show you why Flux Charts is the best in the business. They wanted to sponsor today's video to show you how powerful their premium indicators actually are. I have previously tested them on this channel and had insane results. And for only the price of one takeaway a month, you could gain access to life-changing indicators and an amazing community of other like-minded traders, all the way from beginner to expert, that are making money the same way you want to. So check them out risk-free with the first link down in the description and in the comments section and seeing exactly how much value they cram into this tiny membership fee. Flux Charts has been very generous to offer you a 20% off if you use code MO at checkout. So please, please go check them out for yourself. And thank you again to Flux Charts for sponsoring today's video. So let's get back to it. Okay, so we open the community scripts tab. We're going to type in BTMM and add the BTMM TDI to our chart. I have showcased this on the channel before, and you may have even traded with the TDI yourself, but you're still going to want to see this. Now that we've added it to the chart, let's change some of the settings. So double click, let's untick the background color, volatility upper and lower, trend up and down, and change the upper level to 68, and the lower level to 32. And finally, I like to change the RSI line to green, as that's our main focus. You can also change the balance line to red, You'll see why soon. Now, the TDI, or Traders Dynamic Index, uses the 68 level and 32 level to help spot market reversals. And you may have even tried this day trading, but the problem with the TDI is people try to catch these market reversals on the lower time frame. For example, when price gets high, people will sell. The issue with that strategy is you aren't seeing the full picture that the market is trying to show you, and most of the time, that will get you burned. On the five minute chart, the TDI may go to the upper zone. That would usually indicate a sell trade setting up, but then price reverses on you. This is probably because the higher time frame charts weren't ready to signal a trade yet. So let me show you where we're going to enter and exactly where we'll exit in profit. For this to work professionally, we'll need to enter a higher time frame. So open the four hour chart. From here, we can use the TDI to show reversals in market price but this time the probability is much greater in our favor. Let me show you how to enter and exit trades. On the four hour chart, we will be watching for the RSI, which is this green line here, to cross above the 68 level or below the 32 level. If you take some time and look at the chart yourself, you will see that on this higher time frame, price will respect the overbought and oversold zones much, much more than the lower time frames which is what day traders usually use. Now for a sell trade, once the RSI line crosses above the 68 level, this white line here, all we have to do is wait. One of the perks of this strategy is there is lots of pairs to trade, so there's almost always going to be a trade to be taken. We will then look for price to turn around. It's very important to note that we don't care what price is doing during the candlestick's duration. We only care where the candle stops at candle close. For the entry signal, we want the green RSI line to cross and close below the red trend line. We only enter the trade if it is still crossed through the red line at candle close, never during the candle's movement. And once the RSI line is through, enter your buy position. Move your stop loss to the peak high of the move. 
If the high is really far away with huge candles, then place it one full large candle away. Now that's all simple, but where do we exit the trade? Most traders look to exit when the RSI line crosses back above the trend line, but we won't be doing that. We will be waiting for price to push down until the green RSI line hits or crosses through the red balance 50 level. This is only at candle close, remember, never during. The 50 level is a massive psychology zone for traders and the market can get pretty messy here. As we can see, this trade hit beautifully. The risk to reward ratio for this strategy on average is between 1.5 and 4.5 risk to reward. And it's an awesome strategy to use because you barely need to be on your phone or PC. Just check the chart every four hours when you're trading to see where the candles closed. The exact same rules apply for a buy trade, just reversed. On the four hour chart, we wait for the trader's dynamic index indicator to enter the oversold 32 level below. Step two, wait for the RSI reverse, usually one or two candles later. Step three, RSI crosses and candle closes above the red trend line. And step four, hold the trade and check every four hours to spot your exit signal. Okay, so now that you've seen how easy it is, let's look at the results. 100 trades would have taken well over a year to mark just on one market. So this is calculated over multiple Forex pairs. It does also work on other markets like NAS 100, gold, and even crypto pairs. So let's show you the results. And here they are, starting with a small $500 account. We achieved a very impressive 82% win rate with 82 winning trades and only 18 losses, making 846% which took the balance all the way up to $4,733. This has to be one of the best trading strategies on my channel so far, and traders always say simple is best. Well, one free indicator and one time frame is very simple indeed. But please, please go check this out for yourself. Remember, like I said, we only wait for candle close before entering and exiting any trades. But I hope you have enjoyed. Please like and subscribe. Check out my course below if you're interested on how I trade. But if not, then there's more than enough content on here with three new videos every week. So why not pick one of these videos right here and I will see you in the next one.